So I might go ahead and do what I said a while ago, which is, look, there goes Honey Baby on the golf cart. Makes me so happy to see her using that thing. She's uh, very strong. She's a runner, a dancer, very athletic. It's very seldom that she will give in to anything that makes things easier. And uh, she's had the flu lately. And to see her using the golf cart to me is sweet because I want her to, I want her to have it and use it and feel like it's hers. She's moving Christmas decorations down to the back trailer back there, you know. And she'd have to make, oh, just imagine how many trips she had to make up and down the hill carrying boxes at a time. It just makes me happy to see her grab the golf cart and go for it. So I was about to say. I might take this plywood off and do what I mentioned earlier, move it forward. Um, uh, yeah, just so I won't make that mistake again. And if I wanted to ever put some pockets up here for some kind of rail, I could mount them on this tongue, where I would, whereas I wouldn't have any place on the back to mount anything. So I think I'll probably do that. There's only one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten screws. 10 bolts, self-tapping bolts. I can zip them out and zip them back in later. The other thing I was thinking about while I was doing that, I know one of my kids had a relative that died a while back and they were talking about having to haul off all his junk. And I remember thinking, junk? He's got junk and you're hauling it off? Don't you want to let me go down there and look through his junk before you haul it off? There might be some good stuff in that. <laughs> and that got me thinking, Every time I bring something like this home, what's going to happen when I'm gone and they decide to get rid of this place and sitting around, they have to haul it off because they don't think it has any value. I'm pretty sure they wouldn't. It's funny, stuff like this, I can see so much value in that, but youngsters might not. Look, there she goes. And Daisy running right along with her. They're so cute. They're so cute. Oh, bless her hot. Bless her hot. <laughs> All right, I think I'll do that right now. I'll go move that piece of plywood right now while I'm thinking about it. T-shirt that comes from the Stuff I Heard podcast, which is put on by my boy, Josh P. Joshua P. So if y'all ever want to become enlightened about things that y'all don't know nothing about yet, go over and check him out. He can tell you about things. He can tell you about stuff. He knows stuff. He knows stuff I don't know. He talks about stuff that I don't know about. So. If you're tired of listening to me yammer away about this and that, you can go over and listen to him do it. And his pretty little wife that's on there and you yammer away about stuff too. I might learn something. Might learn something you never knew before. You never know. You never know. There. Oh, that good. 